So let's talk about team blogs on Hashnode. Team blogs are a fantastic way for companies and organizations to publish content within the ecosystem they already know and love. You can use Hashnode's powerful new editor to write articles, map your own custom domains for free, and share your content within our vibrant community. And did I mention that team blogs are also free of charge? I'm Ronald, marketing executive here at Hashnode, and in today's video, I'm going to show you how you can create one for your team. So launching a team blog on Hashnode is actually super easy. First, make sure you're on the main page and then use this big blue right button over here to start a team blog. Now, the first thing you want to do is define a domain for your blog. This can either be a hashnode.dev subdomain or a custom domain if you already own one. If you want to connect your own custom domain, there is a separate tutorial on this topic, which we're going to link in this video. For now, we're going to use a hashnode.dev subdomain, which we're going to call 101 demo. After checking if it's available, we can move on and create the blog. Now your blog has been created and you can see the URL of your blog as well as the link to the dashboard. Moving forward, you can use the next button to finalize the configuration of your newly created team blog. Feel free to give your team blog a proper name as well as a suitable color that matches your brand's identity. You can also choose between free available page layouts such as magazine, stacked or grid. After finishing the step, you are done with the initial configuration of your newly created blog. Now if we navigate to 101demo.hashnode.dev, we can see that I have chosen a quite flashy color for my blog, but other than that it's working perfectly fine, it has been published, I can create a new draft and I can also see the list of members that are part of this team blog. From the manage blog section you can go ahead and manage your team blog just like your personal one. One important feature is the member section. Here you can invite additional offers to your team blog, share an invite URL and change the roles and visibilities of your team members. Team blog members can either have the role of editor or contributor. Please refer to the section below to see what each role is capable of. And the user that created the team blog has the role of owner. If you want multiple team members to be able to join your blog, it's a good idea to send them this shareable URL. Doing so enables anyone with this link to join your team blog. And the best thing is you don't have to decide on which blog you want to publish your article before you start writing. Just use the same flow as always and decide on which blog you want to publish this right before posting. You can even change the offer if there are many members on the team. That's it for team blogs. I hope it was helpful and make sure to share a link to your blog in the comments below.